guys what's happening atomic summons here and welcome back to skyland now in this episode our goal is to use this wee grass here to make animal farm we want to spawn in as many animals as we possibly can but first i need to go check this chest in my house <gasps> 12 pieces of glass wow we have had a reward from the gods they have given us 12 pieces of glass because we built a house. Oh, wow. Yeah. Now, the reward for having an animal farm is, um, well, the reward is for having one of each animal. And that reward is one I'm looking forward to. It is a uh, diamond sword. Ooh. So I'll make some glass panes here because we can. And pretty up our house a bit. Oh, isn't that better? What a lovely gift from the gods. The gods of Skyblock. Now. There's snow on the windowsills. Hmm, that's pretty. Now. So, we've now built our house. We've got Mob Island. And we want Animal Farm. See, Mob Island's over there. Oh, there's a creepy creeper. I'm going to leave him because I don't really want to disturb him. Now, first and foremost, I want to build numerous farms but we're making a animal farm in this one so one two three four five six seven eight nine i think it's ten the other way so we might need to expand that a little bit because i like even numbers one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fucking hell um i don't plan on you know making it that much bigger but <laughs> okay um we're kind of gonna leave it that way haven't we I need to even it. I think I need to go one out this way in order to do that. Seven, eight. That was nine, I think. Okay, I'm going to leave it as is and go in the middle. One, two, three. In fact, I'm going to make it at the corner instead. So what we need to do is build a small platform and spread the grass over to it. Which isn't going to be easy. It's going to be an absolute sod to do, I know. But we're going to try anyway. Now, I don't want this platform to be massive. And I want it to be dirt, obviously. Now, we have to be careful because dirt is a finite thing over here. We don't have a massive amount of it. I don't know how big I mean. I don't want to make it massive because I don't want to use all my dirt. I don't want to make it big enough that animals will actually spawn on it. I should have really looked up how big that actually is. <laughs> Prepare yourself. Right, so let's very cautiously get not the mushroom, get the dirt out and get a pick out so we can dig it up. And I'm gonna put the glass back in there. We don't want really to lose our presence in the gods so quickly, do we? No no, that would be very bad. Right. So we just have to break some of this down in the meantime while we try and get this grass to spread. This is going to be an absolute sod. But, you got to do what you got to do. I should have really built under this so I could have got these back a lot easier. What a silly, silly billy. Oh well. I'm going to do it anyway. So if we get one of each, we get a reward from the gods of a diamond sword, so it is rumoured. Lovely. Right, so, well, oh, wow, quick. While we wait for that to spread, we want to start on making proper farms. Now, first and foremost, I really want a tree farm. So, I'm going to make one over in this corner. I'm not sure how I feel about working with corners, but we'll do it for now. So, we'll just build a little bridge out then a nice little platform and we'll place some dirt in it and make a lovely tree farm how big do I want it um, realistically I want to have nine trees three by three with two blocks in between so I don't know how big that is but I'm going to have to wing it just to see if we can get a nice, nice common ground that I like the size of so let's do that Come up here and go this way a bit. Now I don't want it 
flow for the I don't want it bang on the edge, you know what I mean? So really the first tree will go here. And then we want two blocks on the side of it, not one there. But we want two blocks on the side of it and have another tree. I think that'll be enough. Yeah, I think that'll be enough. We'll have another two blocks on the side of it. And then another tree. Okay. And then once again, we don't want it right to the edge, so we'll come out a bit more. Hope that we have more cobble. <laughs> well, I'm not entirely sure. Um, apparently not. Okay. Time lapsing will ensue in order to... Um, <coughs> Get another stack of cobble. I'll just, I'll just time lapse for a bit, and you can, you can enjoy this. That'll do. We've got 45. I don't think we've left any. No, nope. we've got 45. That will do for now. We'll return to this. Now, we want two blocks either side of this, yes. And then we want two blocks behind before we get the next piece of dirt in. Just just because I think that's an adequate amount of space, that's the only reason. I, mm, I would have liked more, but I, I, I feel it's adequate. Oh, I missed a bit. I was looking at that like, these numbers don't add up. I've missed something here. And I had. I'd missed a layer. Okay, so there's two blocks left and right. Two blocks front and back. I like that. That feels comfortable to me. It feels like enough space. So for now... I might as well start planting the trees. So we can get them to grow, really. Is there any reason? We want, like, hundreds of saplings. But the sole fact that they're a much, much more renewable source of... You're in the wrong place. Ah, oh, damn it. I don't want to lose a block of dirt. No, come back. Yeah, boy. We caught it. Caught it. Yeah. Right. Now that it's going to, to darkness, I feel like I want to watch out for my island. I wonder if this will turn into grass with snow on it. I, I don't know. I wouldn't have thought so. So I'll get rid of all this snow quickly. That's on the dirt. And then we'll start to build perimeters around and such. I hope this is big enough. If not, I will have to make it bigger. Yeah, we'll leave that as it is. Look at our lovely house we built. We got a nice big chest now. No mobs yet. No mobs yet. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. We can wait. We can wait, you know. We can wait while we wait. Get a bit more cobble. Kinda want to do is stand over the other side of the map and wait and watch. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like stand as far away as I can from it and just hope, hope to God something actually spawns in. Because nothing wants to spawn in at the minute. And it's really annoying. Oh God! I almost fell then. Oh, oh, oh. see, look, this is why we don't risk things the dirt back in. Why won't mobs spawn in? Like loads should be spawning in now. Maybe the platform's not big enough. Maybe you go and make the platform bigger. How much bigger though? How much does it need? Surely, surely, surely this might make it 
easy for them to spawn. Yeah, that's a... Look, one even spawned over there. Why are you spawning over there and not on the place I want you to actually spawn? That's just mean. That's just really mean. Why are you going to be like that, poor zombie? Oh, where's my sword? There it is. Oh, don't die. Come here. Come on. Whoa, don't hit me. There we go. We got a bit of rotting flesh. Mmm. Delicious. With a nice... With some nice father beans and a nice Chianti. <laughs> why, hello, Clarice. Uh, why? Why? Am I not father... Right, if I stand over here, will they spawn over there? I need to put a torch here, though, don't I? They're going to spawn over here. They're going to spawn over there as well. Have I got any planks? I've got one. I could make some uh, woodings. Some torches. <gasps> skeletons! Right. It's very, very important we have skeletons. Because bone meal. And arrows. We want loads of arrows. Come on. Come on, Mr. Skellington. Come on. I'm going to call you Kenneth. Come on, Kenneth. Come on, Kenneth. Come on. Come on. Come on, Mr. Anderson. Whoa. Crawl. Right, shut the door. Ow! Come on. And die, Kenneth. Die. Die. Ah. Ah. Oh, oh, oh. Arrows. I don't think I dropped anything. Two arrows and a bone. Sweet. Oh, what the... Well, it gives you the right to spawn over there. You look, oh my god. Oh, he's fell off. Right, we got a. You know what? Ah, shit, I'm gonna die. You know what, guys? I'm gonna go jump in my house because this creeper's probably gonna kill me. You know what, though, guys? I think I, I, think I, I may have figured out why the mobs don't spawn so well over there. I've just. I've literally just noticed. That that place over there is incredibly close to the actual physical game spawn point. Ah, oh, damn it, damn it! No, the creeper's in the house! No, get out the house! Ah! Why? Why, creeper? Why? I've been invaded by mobs and I'm gonna die again. I don't even have a freaking house to chill in now. Oh, no! Come on, Spidey. Don't kill me. Get off. Ah, oh, damn it. Right. And I'm going to try to not die this freaking time. I'm going to hit him with a pickaxe, I've decided. Go away. I'm getting in my house. No, don't hit me. Off. Right. We lost way too much shit there. All the mobs have gone. Thank fuck for that. Oh, man, look at what this creeper did to my house. Fuck. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Fucking, fucking creepers. Either way, like I was trying to say a minute ago, I think I figured out why things aren't spawning correctly. It is because over there is just above the physical spawn point in the game. And I get the feeling, like, because I know you can't place lava near the spawn. Because, like, griefing and dying and such. I'm wondering if mobs don't spawn, if not at all, if not as much near the actual spawn point of the game. That is my thought. I'm thinking that could be quite a possibility. I want a corner one here, like that. Yeah, lovely. Um, do we even have any more cobble? I think we lost it all. No, we did lose it all. And our bloody pick. Damn. We lost loads. Ah, oh, man, that was like attack of the attack of the mobs there. That was ridiculous. Alright then guys, what I'm going to do is, this is clearly taking a short while, so I'm going to 
off camera, wait for this to spread all the way across, because it will. I'll wait for this to spread, I'll wait for those to grow. And in the meantime, I will mine some cobble off camera and uh, come back to you with some cobble. So, I thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one. Ta-ra.